I mean, I, I look at you going into a young group. I know the sort of person you are, young, uh, you know, a younger coach, relationship guy. Do you think you'll be able to instill some knowledge about what it means to lose a grand final and what that means for the years coming up for this young group? Uh, yes and no. You, when it comes to those sorts of things, you've got to be mindful that it's not your journey as well, right? So it's um, you don't want to necessarily pass on messages to these guys like, you know, back in my day kind of attitude. <laughs> as fun as anecdotes and some stories are, you know, you just, uh, the game does change pretty quickly. and But also, uh, respectfully, they don't give a shit about what, what I felt. And you need to let them learn that. Now, you need to guide them, I suppose, in some degrees. And... Um, try and at least get them to recognize there are so many good learnings that can come from, from something like that, which um, my initial introduction to, to this group and some of the players is you know, they, they won't need too much steering. I think they're, they're well led and luckily they've had some success themselves, many of them in 16. So to then lose last year, I think the, like, you don't certainly have to instill hunger. That's, that's for sure. But you're right, Scott, there will be little things along the way, but in terms of I'm not going to come in there with a mantra of, uh, you know, this is what you need to do, this is the formula, because it just doesn't ring true for every group. 